G'day everyone and welcome to another Star Wars figure review. Next up for you today I'm going to do another one from Wave 7 of the 30th Anniversary Collection and that's the R2-D2 from Return of the Jedi um, on the Endor planet. Um, it comes with a cargo net if you remember the scene from Return of the Jedi when um, Chewie could smell something and next minute they're all trapped in a cargo net. Um, personally I think the net could have been a little bigger because it's quite a squeeze to get all the figures into it. Maybe I could rearrange them a little better but um, I pretty much had to have a few heads sticking out to, to get it right. Anyway, it opens up like so. You can see I've got all the characters in there from that scene. Give you a look, that's the actual net itself. It's made of plastic. Um, I would have preferred if it was sort of more of a real net than plastic. Maybe something that was a little stretchy as well. Um, but anyway, I'll get straight to the figure itself. Um, as you can see, these little my antenna thing there goes up and down. Um, it seems like his leg doesn't move up and down when you twist his head like it does with some of the figures. Um, and he seems to balance okay, look alright. I quite like the um, paint job on his feet making him look dirty and like he's been through the the green um, grass and ferns and stuff on Endor. Another thing that comes with this is also the rack. Um, and you can put him in here like so. Quite a tight fit, but actually you can get him on there, like so. And as I demonstrated in um, the um, video of the Ewoks, you can get these little guys to look like they're carrying him, something like that. I quite like collecting um, a lot of the droids, so this is a definite one to add to the collection. Just love the dirty look of it. He does have wheels on the bottom, so he moves along quite well. One thing that is pretty bad is um, he doesn't have that little spinning um, like grinder kind of thing that would cut through the net. That would have been a nice little addition to the figure. And that's pretty bodgy really that they didn't include that. But we can't have everything can we? Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed having a look at this little R2-D2 with the cargo net and also the, the wooden rack that they carry him on. So until my next review, may the force be with you.